Right then folk, welcome back to another video beer review. Today we've got a beer coming out of Almasty and it is a chocolate stout. There we are. Uh, chocolate stout coming in at 5.2% ABV. Uh, picked this one up from Rehills. I'll just flick the price away. Um, well, it's easily readable anyway. £4.35 for a can. £4.35. So, uh, with gentle roast malt aromas that lead to complex tones of dark chocolate, this traditional oatmeal stout has been infused with liquid cacao, enhancing its chocolate notes. That's a product called Chalaka. And it, chalaka. Oh, God. Chalaka. And it's horrifically expensive. Um, I looked at buying it and using it in something before, but um, just ends up opting for cacao nibs instead. But, uh, yeah, Almasty is focused on contemporary ales that push flavour to the fore. 5.2%, uh, best before October 2024, so plenty of time on it. Um, yeah, Almasty Brewing Co. Uh, water, malt barley, hops, yeast, oats, wheat, and lactose. Um, so I've had this about two months. Yeah, people take. Um stored on the shelf of doom, shelf of misery possibly, where a lot of beers go to die, um, definitely the ones in the advent calendar, but uh, yeah, let's see how this works. I do like an Almasty beers, uh, an Almasty beer even, um, really enjoy this stuff when I'm up north, um, I find their pails a crack, and I've always enjoyed Almasty beers, in fact, I seem to remember my, my first Imperial stout that I enjoyed was, uh, was an Almasty one. Um, Many years ago, um, about ten years ago now, um, if that maybe a little, little bit of lactose kind of floaties coming out, and the carbonation is obviously drawn them up the bottom, up drawn them up the bottom, drawn them up from the bottom, and it's got oddly large bubbles, um, which resemble. The initially resembled the kind of bubbles that you get in like a Rekka beer, which was odd. Um, but yeah, it does look a little touch fizzy for me. Um, notes of dark chocolate, coffee. I just want that to be a lot less thin and fizzy, if you know what I mean. Um, Four scarp has been on a bit long or a bit high. Bye then. Cheers. Nice and chocolatey for sure. Um, but it's just my bugbear with beers, you know, stouts like this. Don't carb it. It's just carved up to fuck. I mean, you got to carb it, but it's too much. Nice and chocolatey. It's not overcarbed, which is fine, but it's going that way. Um, Yeah, dark chocolate, mild acidity, a little bit roasty. Um, there's not that much chocolate in it. It's mainly coming from, which is surprising considering it's gelaka. Um, it's mainly kind of coming from the um, the maltiness, like it's got that roastiness and dark dark chocolate to kind of make maybe from some chocolate malt inside of it. But it's not tasting all that thick considering it's a it's got lactose in it. And also, just that carbonation detracted a fair bit from it as well. It's almost giving you like an acidity from it as well. Yeah, that's a real shame that. I was hoping for big th things from that can, but uh, yeah, Elmasty there, chocolate stout. Not the finest, unfortunately. See you next one. Cheers.